Let's head for the airport. Good old Mother Nature. Wow, some bridge. Hi, Indy. Hello. How did you get over here? While you were off bushwhacking, I found a path. Let's look around. Okay. Stop! I'm begging your pardon, you can't go in there. The temple isn't safe. Can I help you with something? Postcard? Replicas of the temple? Souvenir mugs? No thanks, Mr. Charles Sternhardt, PhD, independent thinker, researcher, and merchant. Well, what can you tell us about Plato's Lost Dialogue? I'm the one who translated it, I can tell you that. I'd worry you were here to steal my last copy, but someone called Mr. Smith beat you to it. Oh no! What can you tell us about Mr. Smith? He showed up last week, a tall man with a German accent and a pistol. He could have taken all my souvenirs, but he only wanted the lost dialogue. What can you tell us about the temple? Glad you asked. The locals claim my an Indian thing. Now I ask you, does this look like the work of primitive savages, or does it seem much too civilized? Why aren't we allowed inside? How do I know that you aren't a pair of silly tourists? I only show the temple to reputable scholars. I'm Dr. Indiana Jones. Is that scholarly enough? Indiana? Sounds like the name of one of your states. Or, or possibly a cat. Actually, it was the name of a dog. Sophia! I'd really like to explore the temple. Tell me the name of the lost dialogue of Plato. I don't know the title. Plato! <laughs> Obviously, you're not serious about this. Title? Hermocrates! A friend of Socrates! Stop! Excuse me, the temple isn't open to the public. Excuse me. Yes? About exploring the temple. Tell me the name of the lost dialogue of Plato. The Hermocrates. That's it. Well now, perhaps I was wrong. You seem to know what you're doing. Walk this way, please. I don't trust this guy, Indy. I know what you mean. Come on. Here we are. Let's see what you can do.
Sophia, let's talk. What's up? Could you talk to Sternhardt and keep him occupied? Okay. Dr. Sternhardt, I'd like to speak to you. I better pick it up first. A monument to the genius of the Mayans. Excuse me, won't you? Wait for me, old bean. Hold up there, friend. Well, any ideas yet? Sophia, let's talk. What's up? Could you try and keep Sternhardt busy again? <sighs> again? He's such a windbag. I've got another question for you, Doctor. Good thing that pest Sternhardt's not around. Excuse me, won't you? Let's see what your friend is up to. Look, the kerosene ate away the tarnish. Remarkable! So, you took my lamp, eh? I hope you know what you're doing. Now I got it. Marvelous! It fits perfectly. Now it looks kind of like an elephant. Amazing! Look at that! Astonishing! Bless my soul, the tomb of an Atlantean king! Here's a small stone disc with images of land and sea engraved on it. I do believe it's a world stone! At last I have the thing! Goodbye, fellow seekers. Wait! Oh no, he got away! Too bad for Sternhardt. He missed the orichalcum bead. I can't reach it. Let's find the airport. Too bad, he's frozen solid. A little too dedicated to his work, I guess. It fits perfectly. Whoa! Look, it melted itself right out of the ice. Let's head for the airport.
This is his house. This is it. Mr. Costa? This better be important. Be firm, but polite. I suppose you're selling something. If it's not a priceless artifact, I don't want it. I hear you know something about Plato's lost dialogue. Maybe so, maybe no. Who are you? I'm Indiana Jones. I'm Costa, and I'm tired of talking to you. Indiana, what kind of stupid name is that? Nice going, Indy. I could have done better. Yeah, sure. Sophia? Yes? Here, you talk to the man. My pleasure. Mr. Costa! Pipe down! I'm coming! He's a touchy old bird. Watch and learn, Dr. Jones. Well, hello, beautiful. Professor Costa, my name is Sophia Hapgood. Madam Sophia? A renowned psychic? I hope my friend didn't pester you too much. He's a friend of yours? Well, no, he didn't pester me that much. Actually, he's named after the family dog. Sophia. See? Hmm, I see. What can you tell us about Plato's Lost Dialogue? What do you want to know? Do you have it? Nope. Have you read it? Nope. Do you know what's in it? Not exactly. Can you get it for me? Sorry. Do you know where we could find it? Well now, that depends. I might trade the information for a rare Atlantean artifact, such as a certain necklace I've heard about. I'll never trade away my necklace. Well then, if that's how you feel, surprise me. Would you do business with my friend here? Madam, I'll do business with anyone. Thanks for your help. Goodbye for now. At your command, madam. Don't be a stranger now. Interesting character. Trade, huh? Excuse me? Yes? I think you better take over. Okay, I'll give it a try. Mr. Costa? You again? What do you want? Let's talk about a trade. Okay, what you got? I'm offering this mysterious eel figurine. Now that looks interesting. You've got a deal, mister. Now listen carefully, I don't know exactly where to find it, but... The Lost Dialogue of Plato is in the Dunlop Collection, got that? I think so, the Dunlop Collection. Very good, nice doing business with you. The Dunlop Collection? You know something, Sophia? I believe Barnett College owns the Dunlop Collection. Dr. Uberman, fantastic news. Corner, at last! 
see what Herr Jones has kindly provided. What on earth? Isn't it amazing? You fool! You come back to show me this, this, this... Prehistoric knickknack? Herr Doctor, I believe this knickknack, as you call it, comes from the lost city. Then we have failed! I see no evidence here of some magical metal plato called Orichalcum! Look here, concealed in the base is this small shiny bead. And it glitters like fire, exactly as Plato described. It's my guess we found the treasure we seek. I never guess! We must test! My God! We've done it! The energy of uranium without any radioactivity! And those smug American scientists know nothing! That gives me an idea! Suppose I place the bee inside the statue's open mouth. <laughs> You saw that? Think of trucks powered by these beads. Think of tanks. Think of airplanes. Use your imagination, Carter. Think big like the Americans. Think of bombs. So why are you dragging me in here? Plato's lost dialogue should be here somewhere. Need some help? No thanks, you just get in the way. Fine. I'll meet you in your office. It's screwed in too tight. It's unscrewed. It's unscrewed. It's unscrewed. It's unscrewed. It's unscrewed. There's nothing of importance here.
I believe it's part of the old Sprague collection. It's an old lecture hall desk, complete with a wad of gum, I'll bet. It sure is gooey. I think I'll stick this on my shoes for traction. What do you know? The gum works! It's much too heavy to carry. It's made out of wax. The wax is melting. There's a manuscript inside. The Lost Dialogue of Plato.